Hey guys, it's Visual Moss here, and this week is going to be pretty hectic, so I decided that I was going to vlog my process. If you guys don't know, I am moving to Hawaii. The reason that I'm moving is because my husband, Tyler, that you guys all know, that I, literally has been with me on this journey like ever since I started my YouTube channel and everything like that, um, is in the military. He joined last year and I've vlogged about it and I've talked about it on my Instagram and everything like that. He is stationed in Hawaii. I haven't seen him in nine months. The last time I saw him was in during Christmas. It's been since Christmas that I've seen him and it is now September so it's been nine months since I've seen him. I was supposed to move like a long time ago um, all the way back in February but because of COVID a lot of things have been pushed back and um, there was a travel ban for a while so I couldn't go. In this vlog, it's pretty much just like my whole process of um, like getting prepared to move because I'm moving this weekend. So this isn't the actual moving vlog, this is just the preparing to move. So um, right here, I actually have already packed my suitcase and my duffel bag. These two items are getting carried on. Um, I'll explain more of those like later on um, once I get to like like packing. I'm packing more tomorrow. Um, because I did that yesterday, so I'll talk more about that later. But today, actually, um, these two gals, you can barely see them, yep, these two gals are going to go get a bath. Um, so my sister-in-law is actually here, she just pulled up, and we are on our way to Pet Supplies Plus, that's where I go, to give them a bath because they have a self-wash station and it's just a lot easier to give them a bath. So that's where we're going, to give them a bath. And that is where we're going to start this vlog at. So that's going to be fun. Um, I'm giving them a bath to kind of de-shed them and make sure that they um, are clean for our flight. And just for this whole like trip in general. Um, because I'm going to try my best to make sure they don't leave a lot of hair. Because both of these dog breeds are pretty well known for shedding. Especially this one right here. <laughs> so I'm trying to make sure that they don't leave a lot of fur or like any fur for that matter. Um, on our flight in general or um, Tyler's friend is going to be picking me up from the airport Well, him and his friend is going to pick me up from the airport when I do arrive to Hawaii So I want to try to be courteous and make sure the dogs are clean for when that they go in his car So that too. So they're getting a whole grooming day today They're getting a bath and then they are getting their nail trim today and I have to do all that But I asked my sister-in-law to help me um, So she's gonna be bathing cloud I believe and then I'm gonna be working with storm So that's gonna be fun and I'm gonna take you guys along with that. So enjoy that <laughs> Storm we're going to the wrong door <laughs> ah, I'm about to get hit with the door <laughs> We can work with it, it's fine. So, if anyone doesn't know, I'm just gonna explain. I'm not giving them regular baths. Um, if any you guys don't know, like a lot of the times you can um, 
bathe the dogs in like pretty much any conditioner. Um, do not get them wet first. You just completely lather them in the conditioner and you have them sit in that conditioner for about 30 minutes. Um, and then after the 30 minutes, you rinse the conditioner out and then you can blow dry them. And it helps with de shedding. So I'm doing that specifically because like I said before that these dogs, specifically these breeds are well known for shedding. And that's what I'm trying to do and accomplish here. So they're now just sitting, being lathered in the conditioner and we're waiting 30 minutes. And then we're gonna rinse them out and blow dry them because they have these blow dryers here. So that will be fun, fun times. You girls having fun? Yeah. <laughs> oh God. that one. Will you quit whining? My God. Also, I did Storm's nails, but I haven't done Cloud's nails yet. I'm gonna do that at home, but 
thought it'd be easier while we were waiting for them to get done to do Storm's nails, but I didn't end up doing clouds, so I'm gonna do clouds when we get home. You guys ready to go? Let's go bye-bye, we got everything. This place is soaked. Oh my God. We are soaked. Your tail is still soaked, Storm. <laughs> Come on, let's go. You can't have treats, let's go. You can't have treats, no you can't. You can't have treats, let's go. Come on, no you can't have treats. Come on. Come on. Leave it. Come on. <laughs> Go. Go. I think I just took a picture of my underwear on accident. Because my phone's in my pants. I just heard the click noise and I'm... I hope it was from my phone or somebody else just took a picture of us. Um, Get him, Bashi Caddy B. <laughs> Get him, Bashi. <laughs> What's that face for? <laughs> I never Caddy B. I never. So we're uh, in Miranda's room, by the way. Hi, everyone. <laughs> She's got her foot up. I'm brushing Cloud because Cloud needs like thoroughly brushed, and we weren't able to do that at Pet Supplies Plus. So I'm doing that here now. I also got to do her nails. So. Also, I'm sorry for the flashing. Miranda has these twinkling Christmas lights. Don't judge the Christmas lights, bitch. <laughs> my puppy. Why is it ugly? Come me! She's so cute. <laughs> She's just sitting here. She's like, I enjoy. <laughs> I accept. I accept. It probably literally feels good, especially since her fur is still a little wet. Pretty you are. <laughs> You're so pretty. Oh, thank you for the kiss. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the kiss. Okay, guys. So it's currently the next day. It is Tuesday. I'm moving Saturday. I'm going to keep like a countdown. But um, I just want to give you guys a little update. Tyler officially moved in yesterday and it went really well. Um, I'm super excited that we've like now officially our homeowners today all i'm doing is i'm finishing up packing so today is actually my last day in this house this house is my friend's parents house i've been living here for a little over a year um the reason i moved in was because of my living situations and they offered me a home here um this room that i've been in has been my own room um in this house but the reason that today is my last day is because um, I'm actually moving over to Tyler's mom's house for the rest of this week, tomorrow morning. But just because of the rest of this week is just gonna, it's gonna go a lot easier if I move over there for the rest of the week. Because Friday they have plans for me. I have like a goodbye dinner going on there. I'm over at their house and spend the rest of the time with them. Um, and then Saturday they are taking me to the airport. Like Tyler's family and stuff like that, they're taking me to the airport. So. And then Wednesday, I'm actually, which is tomorrow, I'm cleaning out my car completely, um, like getting rid of like everything that's in there um, because I'm selling my car on Thursday. So I will not have a car after Thursday morning. So I think it would just be a lot easier just to be over there. So today's actually the last day in this house. So I have to get everything out of here. Um, and today I'm actually cleaning this room because they have let me live here for over a year. Today is just mostly finishing up packing and everything like that and then cleaning this room. That's all today is, but it does, it will take most of the day. So that'll be fun. Alexa, play Apple Music. Here's Apple Music.
Okay, so I am done packing completely. Everything's put away. So, I mean, there's like just a few tiny little things, but it's okay. Those things can like quickly be put away in the morning. But, um, so I'm going to go run through everything that I did. So obviously you guys saw me wipe down everything and go through all of the stuff, throw away what was like pretty much empty and that didn't need to be there anymore. Um, things that were pretty much broken that I still had for some odd reason. We're good to go. And then tomorrow I got to clean up my car. So that'll be fun. <sighs> I'm exhausted. We're getting, we're getting there. We're going. This is fun. <laughs> it's literally been like a little bit later. It's still Tuesday. <sighs> I am so exhausted and my body is like feeling for it. So if you guys don't know, like I was diagnosed with POTS and a lot of physical activity like drains me and today really did it. I mean, lately I've been really drained um, from like doing everything. I laid in my bed and I do not want to get up and do anything else. I mean, luckily everything is pretty much done. I mean, I was feeling it earlier when I was still doing it, but I had to push through. If you guys saw me, I was doing a lot of bending over too. Um, normally I wouldn't do a lot of that, but I had to because I really needed to get this stuff done. So I was like pushing through to do it, but I was dreading it every single time. I mean, it's fine. That's just the life of having these disabilities and that's why like I wanted to take a moment stop this like vlog for a moment like the regular clips to talk about this there's not much else you can do with what you're given so um just gotta take what you can get and then the rest time that you have so luckily I you know pushed through I was able to get you know packing done quickly so then I have still a lot of nighttime or a lot of rest of the day to rest. So it's going to be fun. Tomorrow's going to be really fun. So <laughs> good night and I will see you guys tomorrow when all that fun stuff, other fun stuff. I keep saying when all the fun stuff starts, but the fun stuff has started when other fun stuff starts. <laughs> I'm in so much pain like my body hurts so bad so we got the car packed I'm gonna do a final sweep of my room to make sure that I grabbed everything um, I went to my doctor's appointment this morning and then I did a final um, like I did a final pack of the stuff I needed for last night and then I just packed up my car which you guys saw um, so I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go ahead and show you what the car looks like so this is my trunk it's literally filled up to the, the top you can see right there is the dog kennel. Um, I have my big suitcase, my little suitcase, the huge duffel bag. This duffel bag is Tyler's. It's going in storage. Um, like I said before, these small bags are just um, bags that I'm going to have like for the next few days. And then there's stuff that's getting thrown away. Um, like this is the dog's gear that's gonna go on them the day of the flight and then I'll just throw the bag away. I just wanted it like accessible. I didn't wanna pack it away. And then that stuff that I'm giving to my sister-in-law and then this is the dog's food. So that's not like going with me. This duffel bag isn't going with me. Just these things. And then um, my back seat looks like this um, obviously that book bag is going with me so that's there but I have this box here's the dog's bowls that are actually gonna get thrown away um, or they're gonna get put in storage because I'll need them when I visit um, home but I'm not taking them with me so they're either gonna get put in storage when we come visit for the dogs to eat out of 
or they're getting thrown away, but I need them for the next three days for them to eat out of. And then like I said, my book bag is down there for my flight. And then this is what my front seat currently looks like. So this bag is going to Goodwill. And then this is stuff that I usually have in my trunk. Um, this is all like car necessities. And then this is an empty container that had dog stuff in it, but right now it has stuff that I have to take to the post office. So now I'm just about to do a final quick sweep of the room and the house in general. I'm gonna grab the dogs. For now, I'm gonna say my goodbyes and here soon leave this home and head to my mother-in-law's. It's Wednesday guys and I move in two days. It's great. Hey. Thursday. Uh, right now I'm at my DMV and I just turned in my registration and my license plate. No more Cloudy V license plate. But yeah, so that's pretty much all I'm doing this Thursday. Um, other than that, it's pretty chill. So there's not much else for today, but that was it. So now I'm just officially saying goodbye to my car, my first car. It's very sad. <laughs> it's a sad day. So it's currently Friday. Um, like 10 o'clock at night. I didn't end up vlogging anything today because it was actually a pretty eventful day, but I didn't end up vlogging it because it, I, it was just mostly spending time with family. Um, this morning we just went and got pedicures and then all today I've just been home, but we had a little party with my friends, the friends that I've made while living here, you know, all that stuff. And I've had to say my goodbyes to everyone here. Um, not my family yet, but my friends, and it's just been a really rough night, so I wanted to come on here and just explain that and, like, talk about my experience about that. This, at this moment, um, I'm feeling pretty nervous. Um, I'm extremely sick feeling. Um, I'm really sad, actually. Uh, I don't really have any kind of excitement at the moment because I'm just mostly sad because I just had to say goodbye and they were really difficult. I'm sure like, you know, the excitement will come tomorrow because I'm moving tomorrow. Tomorrow I have to wake up at like four o'clock in the morning and I have to leave here at five o'clock and then I have to be at the airport at 5.30. So here soon I'm gonna go to bed after I like put all of my stuff that I need to on the charger and do some last minute things before I go to bed. And then um, 
I am moving tomorrow. So that's the end of this vlog because this was just the preparations for the move. But yeah, and then other than that, my body is in so much pain. But yeah, that's pretty much just me ending off this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and um, I'll see you guys in the next one later. <laughs>